Hello people, I'm Mike and in this video I'm going to take you through how to solve any quadratic equation on the calculator without any stress. Okay, so in case you've met this question, you know, in a test or exams or, you know, yeah, you've met this question, okay, how are you going to do it? I'm sure probably you, you know how to do this one, but do you know how to do it on a calculator? It always comes in handy when you know how to do this on a calculator, even if it's subjective. You can actually do it on a calculator to check whether what you've done, if you're factorizing or you're completing the scores or probably using the formula to do. You can do it on a calculator to check if the answer that you've gotten is correct. Okay? And even if you get this one in um, objective, then it's just a plus. You just put everything in a calculator and to give the answer and you just choose it. Okay? Great. So, this is what you're going to do. You press the mode, all right? Now, when you press the mode, you see um, the first one, the second one, a uh, complex is starting at base end. The feet one is EQN, that's the equation. So you press five, all right? So you see you've got um, different, different kinds of equations, okay? Now, this type of equation is a quadratic trinomial. That is the third one, okay? The third one, all right? So when you press the three, you see that this one will come on the screen. A quadratic trinomial or a quadratic equation is an equation in the form ax, okay, plus um, bx plus c. Okay, so this is a, this is b, this is c. You get it, right? So what you're going to do is to put in the, um, the coefficient, all right? So the first one, x, the coefficient of x is 1. It's not written there, but it's, it's there, okay? So 1, you press 1 for a. When you press 1, then you press equal to. And that coefficient is negative 6. So you press minus 6, okay? Then equal to. The next one is 7. So you press 7. Then equal to. Okay? But after that, you see that they will give you the answer that, you know, the first root is 3 plus root 2. Okay? Then the second one is 3 minus root 2. All right? This is the type of question that you can do by factorizing unless you use the... Uh, method of completing the square to actually do it or probably the formula. All right. Yeah, so that is how you do it and you get the answer for it Okay, so let's do the B All right, so it's already there I can decide to just clear the memory and then Start the whole thing again. All right, so I said you press the mode then you go to the feet one that is equation okay then this type of equation is a quadratic trinomial that is the third one okay so you press three then it will go to the um, quadratic equation mode okay now this is the a eight is the b and this is c so a is three you press three b is minus eight so you press minus eight then C is 5, so you press 5, okay, then you press equal to, so the first root is 5 over 3, and the second root is 1, okay, guys, that's it, that's how you do um, quadratic equation on the calculator, any quadratic equation, all right, you just do it on a calculator like this, and then you get all the roots that you need, okay, right, so in case you're new to my channel, You'd have to subscribe to the channel and then you press the notification button. All right. So in case uh, anytime I put the video here or put a lesson here, you're not going to miss out.